More guns are finding their way into the hands of kids, but not in the way you might think. The high school sport of trap and skeet shooting is gaining popularity in the FM area. Valley News Team's education reporter Veronica Marshall talks to athletes and coaches about why the sport is so valuable for students. It's just kind of a way to get away and you just come out here and you don't have to worry about anything else other than just shooting at a little target in the sky. Cooper Solly was a three sport athlete at West Fargo High School, but he says being a part of the school's target team gave him a break. Football is very brutal. Uh, you, you get beat up after every game, but this is just a little peck on the shoulder. It's fine. It doesn't really hurt. And he isn't the only student who's benefited from being on the team. This sport is inclusive in the fact that male, female, handicapped, um, you name it, they can get out there and they can perform. Cooper's father and the team's coach, Mark Solly, says the sport also earns high marks from parents due to how safe it is. He says because of this, the sport's popularity has been growing. We've grown each year a little bit. We were just doing it as like a club team. And then after like two or three years in the club, uh, high school teams here and there started kind of uh, like getting into it. And then now it's crazy. There's a bunch of schools and it's a huge state tournament every year. Just three years ago, North Dakota's state tournament broke records by having more than 250 student athletes compete. This year, more than 1,300 student athletes from more than 50 different high school teams are expected to come here to compete. Organizers also expect more than 1,000 spectators. Solly says the sport's popularity is encouraging because it means more students will have more opportunities to find the same outlet and acceptance his son did. The kids that haven't played other sports, and this might be the only thing they've competed in or, or sport they played, um, and you see it and, and it's, it brings them into that team concept. It's, they're part of something. I think it's awesome. It's a way that kids that don't or aren't in any other sports can get into this one and have fun. In Horace, Veronica Marshall, Valley News Live. Minnesota's Trap Shooting Championship is this weekend as well. Moorhead students and others from our area are traveling to Alexandria to compete in what's being called the world's largest shooting sport event. For more